back here in Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020 with the Salty 747. It's a plane we haven't flown in a long time. We have an actual real heavy here, like a heavy heavy here in the simulator. So it has been updated since the last time I flew it. So let's just jump inside and see what's happening. The best thing is that the APU is now working well. So we can get the APU running and use that kind of use the APU's power to power our aircraft instead of being forced to use the um what is it external power start so let's go ahead and turn these to auto okay this works nicely the um unfortunately the um like these pack switches are still in op and the hydraulic switches are also still in op so you don't have those yet i guess they'll be coming later but FMC works, everything else works, all the basic stuff works. You can have a nice flight running around. Oh, V speeds are. Let's put those back in. Okay, there we go. They're in again. Let's make sure our flight plan is still working because it accidentally turned it off when. Okay, good. Hang on a second. Let's go to initial reference performance. Aha! That's not our flight level. We want to go to. Let's do 350. There we go. That's more like it. We'll just take 350 for now. Um, everything else is looking pretty good. We've been cleared 8,000 feet, so we can go ahead and push back flight directors on. Auto throttle arm. They'll have VNAV ready to go. So we can go ahead and get out of here. Transponder set. Turn this to RTO. So we have been given runway 02, I believe. 02 left, which is. Here, I believe. So let's go ahead and get over there. So let's get ready. The APU bleeds are on. The packs don't turn on and on, so those don't really make any difference to what we're doing here. So let's turn on the beacon. To both. Call the pushback. Get all the doors closed if all the doors are in fact closed. Pushback. Clark Ground Northwest 547 Heavy requesting pushback. Northwest 547 Let's have it push us back so we can get out of here. Head to Taipei, by the way. From here in Clark, so it's going to be interesting if we can get out, get off the runway in time. We're light, so it shouldn't be much of a problem. Don't have a whole lot of fuel. Shouldn't be an issue. We should be able to get out of here quite easily. Where's the pushback? There it is. Okay. So let's just start the engines. Start engine number three first. This is a 747-8. You just pull it. Flip that. This is an auto start plane. I think we can use the engine indicator. Yeah. Status status is not working for reasons. It's kind of an important one too. See your APU if it's running properly or not. So. I obviously don't like the fact that it's not working. Clark ground northwest 547 heavy requesting pushback tug to steer the aircraft to the right. Northwest 547 heavy, your request has been transmitted to the operator. Beacon should be up and running. I switched it to both, so that both of them should be on. There it is. It's on. Push back. Stop. Clark ground northwest five four seven heavy requesting the end. Jump back in. Northwest five four seven heavy requesting. We get whiplash. Parking brake was on. Running. So let's start engine number two. Of 
all the start, all you gotta do is supervise. Same goes for the 787. At least an X plane, anyways. Two out of four engines running. Take a while, so I'll just fast forward through the startup process. Okay, we're here on the runway, so let's go ahead and get ready to go by first turning on the landing lights. I'm going to turn off light in case something happens, but I don't think that's even possible with this airplane yet to have a failure. Strobe are going to go on. Navs are already on, beacons on, these are all good. Let's get the transponder on, that's an important thing to have turned on. It was already on TARA the whole time, it wasn't ever off or on standby. Okay. Should have checked that. WXR, okay, there we go, we got that up and running. Flight directors are good too, so. Let's get some clearance to leave this place. Clark Tower Northwest 547 Heavy ready for IFR departure runway 2 left. Northwest 547 Heavy altimeter 29 or decimal 9 or 7 wind 0 e 3 and 1 0. Cleared for takeoff runway 2 left. for takeoff runway 2 left northwest 547 heavy. Okay, we're clear. I thought I was out of trim for a second, but um, we'll just leave it because I think that's it automatically, by the way. I'm just not sure how this airplane works compared to the others. And the controls I have set here and the controls I have set for X plane are not the same, so that's also something I gotta deal with. Co pilot handle radio comms while I focus on buying the aircraft. There is Mount Barayat, Barayat over there in the distance. And let's go ahead and power up. our takeoff power for today. It'll make it. Got a light plane and a long runway. I feel like we're being pushed off to the side though. You want? Rotate. Positive rate. You're coming up. And we're going to go ahead and turn out of here. Northwest by 47 heavy contact, Manila Center on 128 decimal tree. Good day. 128 decimal tree, Northwest 547 heavy. We are Manila out. Center, Northwest 547 heavy is at 1,500 feet, climbing 8,000 feet. Northwest 547 Heavy Manila Center Altimeter 29 or decimal 9 or 7 continue to Nabal as planned. Will do, and I'll see you guys at cruise. Okay, hello, we are here at cruise altitude, flight level 350, on our way to, you can see the aileron freaking out there, cool. On our way to Taipei from Manila, so, our northwest plane here, things are looking okay, so, aside from the well, frame rate is, frame rate's fine, just got some heat blur out there, which is cool, but anyway, everything's going fine, we're good. 
Um, let's make sure the flaps are all the way up. Indeed they are. That's just... The airplane is probably holding itself in the wind or something like that. That's what's going on there. Either way, we've got something good going on here. And we're on the way. So, enjoy the segment. I'll see you guys on Descent. Okay, so we have just been told to descend, so we're doing that. So we're gonna go ahead and start getting in, and this time I remember to turn the seatbelt sign on. So there we go, that's on. So let's get ready to get into initial reference. Let's go ahead and do performance. Initial reference, do we have, okay, approach. Let's do approach. Let's do this. Okay, there we go. Route. We have the Navrad. Oh, ILS is already in. Okay. So we'll see how that goes when we get closer. How we can get it in there. But um, it's already pre-programmed apparently. That must be new in the simulator. So. Let's go with the legs. And set auto brake to 1. Actually set the 2. We're heavy. The reason being I put this in as pounds in the UI for the initial flight simulator and now it's showing us kilograms so yeah the conversion happened with the same number between two different units between the sim and the plane so the sim and this plane are no longer talking to each other but um okay I'm okay with that because it makes something easier some things harder but this you can still change your flight plan in the sim from within the airplane but the other way around isn't really working anymore anyways that's that let's set the minimums by the way Okay, it's already set. Good enough. Good. Good for us. Right. I'll see you guys on the final. Well, I've got the runway in sight. We're good. ILS just refused to work. I thought it was tuned already, but it's not apparently, so I have to do this visually. Luckily, today is a good enough day to do that. So I've got full manual control of the aircraft, throttles, and position everything are under my control. Oh, it's windy. 25 knots. Okay. Runway zero five left northwest five four seven heavy. Let's put that's in this flight. Okay, we're good. Still looking pretty good. Still looking okay. Gear down, flaps full. Not sure how to arm the spoilers in this guy. You can't just smack the lever over like you could in um, X Plane. You get to actually have to reposition it. But I, I just tried it, didn't work, so we'll just do manual spoiler deployment. Co-pilot, hope you've got your hand on the spoilers, because we're going to need it. We touch down, deploy them. We 
touchdown to play those spoilers. Looking okay, looking okay. Frame rate is awesome. Okay, level out. Awesome. Reverse. Um, why? With the reversers? Okay, let's have them do manual braking then. And spoilers deployed. I think we kind of got off a little bit. We have spoilers. I mean, reverse. There we go, reverse. I hate the fact that reverse isn't indicated. Almost got off the runway there. I will live with that though. Alright, welcome to Taipei. When you guys are Taipei. Okay. One, two, one, seven. So let's see. Do we do the manual spoiler deployment? Yes, we did. And the reversers are activated, so let's put the reversers, bring the spoilers in, and retract the flaps. Right, so now, APU start. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Ten. Should be running now, so let's turn off the landing lights. Turn off the runway, turn off the light, leave the taxi light on, strobes can go off. What else? WXR off. Hit that traffic switch. Really the traffic switch on. We can just turn the TCAS off. Stand by. Standing by. Okay. TCAS should be off, but AP running seat belt part brake set. Flaps are coming up. We didn't start the chronometers, so we're okay. Anyways, that's that. Let's, get, let's go to the gate. Taipei ground, Northwest 547 Heavy request taxi to the gate. Northwest 547 Heavy taxi to gate Alpha 5 using taxiway November 8, November Charlie, November 7, November Papa. Taxiing to gate Alpha 5 Five Taxi is checking November, where I want to go November Charlie, November 7, November Papa Northwest 547 Heavy Oh, nope, that's the wrong one Ending in taxi guides, there we go So, I will see you guys at the gate Okay, we're here at the gate And as you can see, they're parking us next to a company plane Which is cool I don't think we have a marshaller though, so let's get in carefully as we possibly can. They did not gift us with the marshaller. Not only is it a company plane over there, it's the same aircraft type. It doesn't exist in real life. This aircraft type does. This airline I won't be wearing this library though, but this airline is on. Uh, operating anymore. The only one that absorbed it doesn't use 747s. The only one that absorbed it, that being Delta, the only types that they still use that were from Northwest, I think, are the 330 and the 320s. So 757s too, I believe. Delta does have 757s. Still, I think. If somebody was retiring, I can't remember if it was Delta or Mir. Okay, so let's stop. Perfect, the jetway is coming out to meet us. So, we 
you're getting helped. Parking brake on. Here we go. The jetway is coming out to meet us, so let's go ahead and uh, get ready for it by turning on the APU generators and shutting, turn off this taxi light. Let's shut the engines down. We opened the door before the engines were even ready to open, but before the engines were even down, so uh, yeah, it is what it is. These won't go off for some reason. That's odd. Thought they'd go off with the flight director, but I guess not. Okay, seatbelts off. Turn off the fuel pumps. Oh, just turn the beacon off too. We don't need it anymore. Nav lights can stay on though. Fuel pump lights have been fixed. They're working now. Turn the window heat off. Oh, to work together. Let's go ahead and turn these any ices auto off. Because they might turn on automatically if the temperature is in the right area. We don't want that happening. These still don't work, but uh, okay. That's as much as we can do for now on this aircraft. And the jetway has come up to meet us, so we're good. Right next to a company plane. So let's see if we can get some other ground services in. Ground services. Let's get the bagging. Type the catering. ground northwest 547 heavy. Could you please send the catering truck? Northwest 547 heavy. We can't send your catering truck. Please retry later. It's right there. Okay, I want the baggage. Type A ground, Northwest 547 Heavy, could you please send the baggage? Northwest 547 Heavy baggage is on the way. Okay, so baggage is coming, let's try catering again. Type A ground, Northwest 547 Heavy, could you please send the catering truck? Northwest okay, now it's coming. Heavy, the catering truck is on the road. Just need to register the, you see, just need to register the fact that we're actually here. But that's that, anyways. Cool beans, haven't heard that phrase in a long time. I'm not even sure why it exists, but it is what it is. We have arrived. Thank you for watching. See you guys next time. And goodbye.